I believe this thing has started. Tonight is going to be a rant about YouTube, uh, not YouTube, sorry, Facebook um, fish forums, okay? It, it, it's getting ridiculous, people. It, it really is. Um, you know, here's where I'm going to start. Take a look at one I run. You know, North American Guppy Breeders and Questions is just one of the forums I run. Matter of fact, I'm the sole runner of that. See a description over here? Okay? You got to put rules down, people. You have to put rules down. Okay? Is this thing still running? Yeah, looking good. All right. But you have to put rules in effect. I was kicked off a forum last night, and I'm not going to mention a name. A lot of you can probably figure out what forum it is, and it's supposed to be for YouTube people, you know, to get their name out and blah, 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 you know. Um, but the problem is, like, on this forum, I have one other mod that I keep in touch with, but the rules are plain and simple, okay? You know, I state exactly what it has to be, and that's it, you know? This forum had no rules at all. You've got about, I don't know, probably ten different mods, maybe five, six, seven, eight. None of them know the rules. There are no rules posted. So it kind of offended me last night. And, and again, I don't care if I get picked off or kicked off a forum. I, I'll show you some stuff here. Now, what I will tell you straight up front, you might be able to figure some of this out, but I'm not going to mention the forums. Uh, I think I blanked out everything I could, but I probably missed something. Oops. All right. Here's what got me kicked off. <clears throat> Whoops. I didn't mute the name. Uh, well, Rack Cross. I'm not sure who Rack Cross is. I think I blanked everything else out I could. Hint, hint. Um, anyway, somebody asked about putting something in the comments. I'm not a mod on the site. I really don't care. Um, I've got five sites I mod anyway, and I'll show you more examples here in a little bit. Um, I believe we should not intensively promote. Well, I thought the whole point of this site was to promote your YouTube channel, get your name out there, get you some likes, get you some hits, get you, you know, get recognition out there. And somebody asked something, and I just typed in, which I don't have the screen shot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What am I doing? Yeah, I can't control that. This is a screen capture. Uh, anyway, I keep moving up and down. Somebody asked something, I was like, yeah, just post it in there. Who cares? Um, But, you know, should not extensively promote. I understand that. That's cool. Um, I like to see his page as a help page rather than a promotional page. That being su uh, said, I'll support either. However, as a mod here, I have no clear direction to help page without knowing the intended direction. That tells you there's too many cooks in one kitchen, people. Okay? On this site. And again, I'm not saying who it is. Hint, hint. But anyway, when you got a bunch of mods in here, nobody knows what the rules are. Um, there's no rules posted here. Now, of course, I can't go back up. I can't get back in the group because apparently they kicked me. But anyway, I said um, I post links for the fish fam. And I'm reading this off because a lot of you might be on iPads or phones. And there's no way you can see this, all right? Um, uh, normally, for me... And there were 30 replies underneath the guy, right? So, anyway, I said normally is 95% normal, you know, I do a normal video or a giveaway. And I will post the links to the site. I've always done that. I did one uh, last year. A lot of you people probably bought some things from me where I may have posted one video on this site saying, you know, hey, here's the end of your giveaway, massive discounts, whatever. But I posted on about... I don't know, probably, I don't know, six or seven different sites, you know, that I mod and whatever. Anyway, um, uh, in the year, I guess the question remains what is acceptable. Rat Cross, y'all can look him up, and I believe he's a decent YouTuber, okay? 
profiteering is not acceptable. Capital letters. What the, how am I profiting, dude? You know, I post a site at the end of your giveaway. Or, well, end of your sell, okay? So, I don't know. Are giveaways acceptable? I don't know. Are posting videos acceptable? I have no idea. Um, and can I not post a link on here to say, hey, I'm slashing prices because I have to get rid of all this stuff for Uncle Sam. But anyway, Rat Cross, and y'all can look him up. And I would have deleted his name and everything else. I'm just, I don't know, trying to take the high road. Y'all can figure out the rest of it. Um, put in there, I lost money, you know, and I did. Uh, I didn't profit. Because at the end of the year, if you run a business, people, y'all do understand you have to take inventory. And if you don't run a business, you have to take inventory. And guess what? You have to pay X amount on your inventory, whether it's sold or not. I don't know if any of you knew this, okay? There's a lot of rules and <clears throat> regulations because you got to set the prices for next year. What if the inventory lost value? What if it gained value? Um, because maybe the fish food you're selling is rarer because the business went out uh, or the company you got it from is rare or I'm sorry I'm getting ahead of myself there's a lot of vernacular in there I'm not gonna get into that so anyway uh oh crap all right so sorry to hear the G or TGA is not a billboard for asking for money whether it is profit or not I didn't ask for money I posted a freaking link people it said you know, hey, here's the end of your sale. And no one said anything last year, okay? Now, keep in mind, this is what, January 10th? Um, I put a link in this wet, or this chat um, probably on the 24th, 25th, 20th of last year. No one ever said anything, all right? I was just answering someone else who wanted to post a link to say, I've got something, uh, I'm getting rid of things and discounted or something. I, I don't remember what it was. But anyway, um, so we're going to go down here. Uh, and I told him, I, and I was not being bragging here. I know you can't hardly see this. You know, my name's Scott Burden, B-U-R-D-E-N. A lot of you probably know me, maybe you don't. But anyway, I said, you know I'm fancy tell aquatics, right? Got many videos posted, advertise at least our name. And what I meant by that, I probably should have typed that better. I meant anybody putting a video link on the site or any other site, what are you doing? You're advertising your name. You're advertising your brand. It's just a link. Yeah, you're not selling anything maybe, but you're advertising your brand. In other words, you want people to watch your videos. And in turn, that turns into views, that turns into subs, and... If you got merch, you know, listed underneath your title name, guess what? You know, now you got a potential to sell some merch, okay? I didn't do anything wrong anywhere, I don't think, but, you know, what do I know? Um, so anyway, down here, yes, you posted an advertisement on TGA. Again, he had no idea I posted it, and it was at least a few weeks beforehand, potentially, see? And... What do you call them? Brackets, maybe? I don't know. Everyone knows. Everyone knows you are Fancy Tail Aquatics. I doubt that. I really do. I mean, my name is clearly Scott Burden here. I will post a link. You know, how would everybody know who Fancy Tail Aquatics is? I don't post as Fancy Tail Aquatics. But again, and um, I typed the last thing down here. Well, if you feel an end-of-year advertisement is a huge thing that benefited over 20 people, yeah, that's not a lot. I get it. But about 20 people bought stuff from me. That helped me out. That helped clear out the end-of-the-year stuff. I said, my bad. I was trying to clear inventory. So then I suggest any giveaways, posts, spam, and so on should be held for review. And it got booted. You know, at that point. So I don't know if this rat guy booted me or another mod from the site, really don't care. I really, really don't care. But I'm just saying, when you have too many 
cooks in the kitchen, you know, as far as admins and uh, moderators and this and that, and you don't have a clear direction, then, you know, get your ducks in a row, people. Really. Um, let me go to, uh, I believe, one of my websites. Yeah, right here. This is a different website than I listed earlier. And a lot of this right here, maybe some of y'all can't see on your small phones, is real simple. This is this group is a group uh, developed to share the love of guppies to our customers and guppy, uh, um, you know, hobbyists around the world. As of August first, two thousand eighteen, any post selling will be required to provide a selling price up front. This would prevent people from selling different prices to different people. Okay, we'll be adding files um, for items and guppy strains that are available for sale in the U.S. only. So keep in mind, U.S. only. This is why on this channel, everybody that applies for membership, the first thing I do is I tap into your name. Okay, I try to see where you're from. I look at pictures. Do you actually have pictures of guppies or any type of fish or pets in any of your photos? If you don't, and you're definitely not from the U.S., I, I'm going to decline you, okay? That is simply a rule. If you are from the U.S., um, and you don't have any pictures in your photos of pets, now some people keep their photos private, keep that in mind, so I can't always see it. I just go by the name, and then usually under a name, I wish I had somebody that recently accepted, but I'd have to blank them out if you would. Um, it'll tell all the groups are posted in. So if I look underneath there and see you're posted in four or five different fish forms, no matter what it is, or at least pets or dogs or cats, yeah, I'll accept you, okay? Um, and then finally, along with items to with items to make your guppy keeping the easiest as possible. Okay, now this is Fancy Tail Aquatics and KB Southern Guppies up here. Um, I also run the North American Guppies and Breeders. And again, looky here, more rules, more rules. Okay, this is a little stricter. Um. But anyway, they're they're basing here. All my mods understand that, you know, if we go to accept somebody, um, you know, what's going on? You know, we, we know the rules, and occasionally something's going to fly by. And yeah, I can't always go and scroll, you know, through every single post down here. And I mean, somebody might post something bad, you know, or you know, whatever. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Derogatory, homophobic, or just bad, bad juju. You know, I'll immediately remove them because I do, um, you know, as mods, we can easily pull it down here, you know, and uh, delete post and remove author. And delete post. If we delete post and remove author, then I believe there's a choice after that they can never ever be invited back. That means even if a mod makes a mistake, uh, I don't even believe they can apply. So anyway, <clears throat> let me see where I'm at on here. Eh, 13 minutes. I'm about done with the rant. I don't think I have... Yeah, I'm not going to show some of this because it's not censored. Um, <clears throat> but anyway... Um, Let's just keep in mind, people, if you're going to run a forum, have you two or three good mods post freaking rules so we know exactly what is going on, okay? You know? And if there is something that is not described in the rules, then add it in there. But I've seen one time I was in a forum, um, I can't remember what it was. Now, don't get ridiculous. There were, like, individually 25 different rules. You know, you could not post fish on a Tuesday. You could only do it on a Wednesday. And you had to add the price. And rule 20, you know, rule 19 was probably something like, um, you know, you can't do this, but you can do this, but you can't do that. 
I mean, come on, get with the times. So anyway, you know, I'm not going to say anything else about Team Green Alliance. Oops. And I don't mind getting kicked. But if the whole purpose is there is to promote your channel because you're a small timer, you're not Corey, you're not Flip Aquatics, you're not freaking, um, you know, whoever else, I, 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 you know, maybe even Michael's Fish Room. I, mean, I think he's kind of big. And that guy gets kicked out of a lot of forums. I'm going to tell you that right now. Um, and I can understand people getting upset. Put in rules, man. Like, for instance, if... You know, put in a rule and write it right here. If you're going to ask a question about fish, tell us exactly water parameter, pH, water temp, you know, uh, ammonia, uh, you know, nitrates, nitrites, you know, and all that stuff. Listen right off the freaking bat. That way if somebody comes in and says, hey, I just bought fish and my fish are dying, you can quickly say, did you read rule number one we posted? Don't get out of hand. But if you're going to, like, limit people, um, you know, like right here is a prime example. Oh, I don't, well, whatever. I don't care. You know, good price for $11. Well, I'm a host, I can buy wholesale. And I told her, yeah, I have a lot of accounts as a registered business with a tax ID number, reseller license. What is, what is your version of cheap? You know, in case of 24, it'd be at least blah, blah, blah. So eventually I told her. If you got three of these for $11, unless she paid $20 of shipping, that is cheaper than I can buy wholesale. How she gets it, where she gets it from, that's none of my concern. So I don't care if people advertise this stuff. And this was January 8th, so only a day or two ago. Um, you know, I can't compete. I like helping people in that way. All right, I'm done with my rant. I'm sick of it. <laughs> I'm not sick I even had to do this. So I'm going to cut it cheap, short, and I hope I didn't offend anybody. But a couple uh, people, I'm not going to mention their names, uh, a few females um, who belong, well, they're known, um, you know, told me to take the path of, uh, you know, Jesus, the righteous path. And I did. I don't think I've exploded a lot. I probably didn't give a lot away. I probably should have uh, muted the guy's name. But, you know, I don't know. I just felt something had to be said. So if I'm in the wrong, you all tell me. If I'm in the right, you tell me. And, you know, again, I have no idea. Because I never saw any rules posted on that particular site. So, yeah, what do I know? All right, thanks a lot. God bless. Y'all have a great evening, and uh, thanks for visiting. Laters.